All right, Kenner's going to show uh, the Kenner, <laughs> the Kenner Kimura. All right, so watch this. All right, guys. So think real quick of a traditional Kimura. You're going to have like a little wrist control, and your other arm's going to go over the shoulder, under the wrist. Of course, contain your own wrist here. So that same idea is going to translate. If John passes my guard and ends up here in side control, I'm going to reach underneath with my inside arm and look to block this arm and get some kind of wrist control. All right. Now. I can't just come over the shoulder under the wrist because I'm not in a great position. So I gotta scoot out, bring my leg, my outside leg that's closest to his head over the shoulder, under the wrist, and just so that he can't rip that out, I'm gonna triangle his wrist. Now from here he might look to start stacking me or anything, but I'm gonna keep tight control on this, and I got a couple options. The first is I can start to raise this up ah! to the point where he can't shrink it out, or he may decide to roll forward roll, and from here. I can either take crucifix and look for a choke, or if I want, I can roll up with him and finish him right there. So one more time. As he's kind of passing my guard, I'm going to shoot this arm underneath and get some kind of wrist control. Scoot my hips out. My left leg closest to his head comes over the shoulder, under the wrist, and just contain it there. You can settle for a second. Sometimes I'll look to start attacking this arm as well. But for now, I can raise up with a tap there, or he may roll. I can just come up with him and use it as a sweep. 